Hi everyone. Um, hope you guys had a Merry Christmas or um, whatever holiday you happen to celebrate based off of your belief or culture. Um, I know I said that I was going to do a lot of vlogging uh, the last time I put a vlog on and I didn't do that well. Uh, I had a lot of things that I was doing this past year, um, so a lot of my mind went on that. And, um, anyways, so I will do like a brief recap of what I've been, um, dealing with this past year as to why I haven't done any vlogs. Um, first off, I never got to go to any vacation after my third year was over usually i go someplace with my mom uh somewhere during our break during my break but this time around because i had ojt which for some people who don't know it's on the job training which is basically internship and everyone in our uh, department has to take their OJT during break and um, so yeah that took a lot of my time I will do a separate video uh, about my time and issues during OJT but that was pretty much what took my time and then after OJT went straight into starting my fourth year first semester and there were a lot of things that I was doing and that's where my focus was. I was pretty stressed a lot, actually. Not even just this past semester, fourth year, but also my last semester, the second semester of my third year, that was pretty stressful. Actually, this whole freaking year <laughs> has been kind of stressful. Mentally, physically, emotionally stressful. Uh, not just from school, but home and stuff going back, happening back home also. So, um, yeah, that was a lot of things. And I did get to do some creative stuff and do things that I wanted to do. Uh, not that much, not as much as I would have liked, but... There's always next year, which is soon to come, only tomorrow, uh, so yeah. And um, so yeah, this is going to, after this break, is going to be my fourth year, second semester, and then graduation. We hope graduation. Right now, I'm incomplete in my film and my theater because we are currently having to do those two projects while we're on break because we weren't able to complete them during this semester and uh, I still have to do uh, my thesis. My thesis has been kind of a complicated thing and uh, I'll probably do a vlog just solely on that because it's been kind of stress major stress factor for me um anyways so yeah we'll see if i get to graduate on time with everybody this semester um who knows what's going to happen and if you're wondering what i'm planning on doing after i graduate i really don't know um i know that will probably go back to the States for at least a short time, even a visit or anything like that to get some stuff uh, taken care of, um, but then probably come back here uh, for a few months or whatever to get everything situated if we do plan on moving back home in the States or if there's some sort of opportunity either here or in another country. I don't know. 
I'll be probably looking and putting any feelers out. I don't really have any solid plans because basically I've learned through the years that there is no such thing as solid plans because every time I've made any real solid plans and put all my effort into it, it never usually happens because, well, life shit happens and things tend to veer to a different direction and before when I was younger anytime that happened and I focused just on one certain plan and that didn't end up happening because of some sort of event or thing in my life that I had no control over usually would throw my plans up in the air and then I'm shut out of luck because all my energy and all my emotions went towards that one plan and that screwed me up big time whenever I was doing that so I kind of just stopped doing that pretty much I have like these initial ideas um, like a plan A, plan B, plan C but nothing solid because you know I'm open to whatever ends up happening. You never know. Um, so there, that's where I am right now. So anyway, I will make a separate video um, after after this video to, I guess, go through uh, what I had to deal with in OJT and um, later on uh, hopefully soon I'll be a during my very very short break um, before I start second semester I hope to make another video that kind of brings up uh, some questions and stuff that one viewer had asked me a few months like a month ago or whatever so I thought maybe some of the answers that I gave her might actually be helpful for some of you other viewers and I might not have brought it up during during any of my videos so maybe that might be helpful to you and so yeah anyway um, what I'm going to be starting to do in my videos is to wear different t-shirts that I have. I have so many freaking t-shirts through the years. I'm kind of um, a, a hoarder at heart and I'm trying to change that little by little and one of the things that I'm trying to get rid of in my life is the ridiculous amount of t-shirts I have. I mean I am not kidding you. I have way too many t-shirts and the thing is what's odd is and I'm pretty sure a lot of people are like this who have like tons of clothes but you only have like this much clothes that you actually use and wear on on a regular basis but then you have all these other hoarded collection of clothes that you hardly ever wear or ever wear you don't even remember you had for like the longest time so what I'm going to be doing is getting through my t-shirts um, one by one and then letting them go like kind of one last hurrah with my t-shirts so like this t-shirt that I'm wearing I don't know if you can tell is G.I. Joe and well why G.I. Joe uh, I used to love this shirt. I wore this a lot. So it's kind of getting ratty and faded and stuff. So I will po probably finally put it aside and give it for donation. Um, but G.I. Joe was one of my favorite cartoons when I was a kid. And um, I was very girly, but I was also a bit of a tomboy growing up. And whenever I asked for girly things and tomboy stuff, 
I would always get the girly stuff, but never the tomboy stuff. I mean, one of the things was G.I. Joe dolls. I never got any G.I. Joe, do Joe dolls, so um, I would always get the Barbie stuff. The only time I think I actually was able to get away with getting a tomboy item was uh, He-Man. But that was only because it was a part of the Masters of the Universe, and She-Ra is part of Masters of the Universe, so kind of they go together. So I guess that was the only reason why I got He-Man. Anyway, but yeah. So now I will send this off to give away for. Um, here we don't have exactly a Goodwill, or at least I think I saw one Goodwill, but that was all the way in Manila. I'm not going to do that. But I will probably donate it to um, one of the communities um, around here, nearby, in our, in our area. So anyway, so yeah, that's the end of this video. I hope you have a wonderful holiday season, and let's make it a good next year because I don't know about you but this 2018 uh, was kind of rough for me very rough for me actually so um anyway I will stop this video Ta -da!